Sophie. Sophie is literally the sweetest girl I have ever met and she did not deserve any of this. She has literally been nothing but perfect to me this entire relationship. When me and Sophie started dating about a year and a half ago, I had absolutely no idea it was going to be this long term. I met Sophie when I was 16 years old and she was a few years older than me and we were obviously in very different points in our life. When our relationship started to get a little bit more serious, that is when social media found out and you guys loved us as a couple, which was great, but also put a ton of pressure on the relationship. As time went on, I felt I was too young and too immature to be in a relationship this serious at such a young age. When this started to really freak me out, I tried to do what I should have done and I went to her house and I tried to end the relationship. However, I definitely could have done a better job on my part of explaining the whole situation to I. Her end, it seemed very out of the blue why I was trying to break up with her and completely random because there's no way that she could have known how or why I felt this way because again, we were in different points in our life. On top of that, Sophie was literally the perfect girlfriend, so it was really hard to explain to her that I just wasn't ready to be this committed to somebody before I was even 18. Throughout that conversation, she ended up actually convincing me to stay, and I hate myself every day for not just being a man and breaking it off when I knew I should have. But also, in the back of my mind, I kind of knew without a concrete reason of why we were breaking up, I didn't know what the hell I was going to tell you guys because you know, as our relationship went on, the Dofi fans were getting stronger and stronger and you guys loved us. After that conversation, we just continued to date. Like, none of that happened. Um, but just because we didn't talk about it didn't mean I stopped feeling that way. Don't get me wrong, Sophie was literally my best friend, so I loved hanging out with her. So many amazing memories that I'm never gonna regret and I'm always gonna remember. But um, this was when, you know, being too immature and not ready started to affect our relationship negatively. I felt trapped in our relationship and I made some choices that I am always gonna regret. There are absolutely no excuses for what I did. There are so many better ways that I could have approached the situation. But again, I was young and stupid and I should have just broken it off when I had the chance. I feel absolutely horrible because Sophie did not deserve this at all. Um, she was nothing but perfect to me, the entire relationship. She was the sweetest girl ever. Um, she did not deserve this. I do not deserve her. And um, Sophie, if you're watching this, I am truly so, so, so sorry. I was kind of expecting Sophie just to cut me off um, and never talk to me again, but she decided she wanted to give me a second chance. So I took it. But after a couple of weeks of trying to rekindle our relationship, we realized that there's no way it was gonna work, um, and we ended up officially parting ways. The way things ended were actually very mature and respectable. Um, we had a couple long conversations about it, and we both agreed that I need to grow up a bit, and that I wasn't mature enough to be in this relationship, and we left it off as still friends. I do not blame her for being upset at me or mad at all, I just felt the need to make this video because obviously in her video, she didn't actually explain any of the information. Again, I'm not trying to make any excuses for myself. I know that I'm completely in the wrong. I should have known I wasn't ready to be in a serious relationship and I should have broken it off. <laughs>